Two scandals which made headline news during the 1990s were the Clinton Lewinsky scandal and the O.J. Simpson murder scandal. The Clinton Lewinsky scandal was a political and sexual scandal which resulted from an affair President Bill Clinton had with the 22 year old intern Monica Lewinsky in 1995. It was kept a secret until Lewinsky decided to tell her friend Linda Tripp, who was a Defense Department worker at the White House, who delivered recordings which Tripp recorded to Kenneth Starr who had already been investigating President Clinton for other things, such as the Whitewater scandal, which had to do with the Clintons' real estate investments. This scandal led to Clinton's impeachment in 1998 because he was found guilty of lying under oath as he claimed that he did not have sexual relations with that woman, Miss Lewinsky. Another scandal during this decade was the O.J. Simpson murder trial, which was a trial involving a black football player O.J. Simpson who was being charged with murdering his ex-wife and her friend. Even though he was eventually acquitted, this case has been continually described as the most publicized trial in U.S. history and took over nine months. It was significant because it showed how race still played an important role as blacks sided with Simpson and whites were sympathetic towards Simpson because he was black. These two scandals show that in the 1990s, the American public was losing faith in both the executive and judicial branches of the U.S. government. These political scandals in the 1990s were followed by a series of corporate scandals which categorized the 2000s, the Enron scandal and the Madoff investment scandal. In 2008, former Nasdaq chairman Bernard Madoff was arrested after a tip-off by his sons for his Ponzi scheme, which is a type of fraud where one makes investment returns seem higher than they actually are by using money from new investors to pay old investors. It was estimated the size of the fraud was over $65 billion U.S. dollars, and Madoff was sentenced to 150 years in prison. This event is significant because people lost faith in the Securities and Exchanges Commission for not knowing about the fraud, and it led to the closure of many charity organizations and businesses around the, around the world. Another scandal during this time, a scandal seen as many but as the biggest scandal of the century, was the Enron scandal. In 2001, it was revealed that Enron had been hiding bil billions of dollars in debt and led to the stock price to fall from $90 to $1, which led to its bankruptcy, the biggest bankruptcy in corporate history. On top of that, many Enron executives were sent to prison, including Enron's auditor, Arthur Anderson. These scandals showed how America showed Americans how crooked the corporate world could be and led to many policy changes which would place stricter measures on companies. In conclusion, even though America has come a long way since 1776, there are still many things that will need to be fixed and improved upon, like our morals. I mean, what can I say? Brown babies in the backseat sing to me. Hey, DJ, won't you play that song for me? In my home, in my home, he's all singing to it. Three, oh.